I'm Paula Chadwick, I'm a professor in the Department of Physics at Durham University and I work on CTA. Uh, I'm doing lots of different things for CTA, um, so along with a lot of the other people in the UK um, I'm involved with building a camera for one of the small size telescopes of the array. Um, I also look after testing the mirrors for CTA, devising how we're going to make sure that the mirrors that we've got will do the job that we need to do. There are thousands of mirrors in CTA and we've got to get them right. I've been doing ground-based gamma ray astronomy for a scarily long time. I've been doing it for 30 years now and uh, it's been really interesting to watch the field grow from a few of us trying hard to get small telescopes working through to um, bigger telescopes capable of imaging and bigger collaborations and now we've got to the point where yes we know how to do this and we're really going to build this fabulous array of telescopes. Um, so I'm interested in all kinds of different objects, um, I'm interested in active galactic nuclei, how they accelerate particles, in binary systems, what they're up to, and also in some of the more unusual aspects of gamma astronomy, dark matter, this stuff that we think fills the universe and we really don't understand, we don't know what it is, um, we don't even really know where it is, we've got a few ideas but we're not completely sure. Um, so one of the ways that gamma ray astronomy could help with that is by spotting gamma rays produced by dark matter and um, I'm involved in trying to work out well where might that be, um, can we use data from a current satellite instrument to tell us a little bit about what we might expect to see with CTA on the ground. Um, so it's an exciting time to be a, a gamma ray astronomer. Um, it's great fun and um, we're hoping we get lots of new and unexpected things when we finally complete the array in about 2024.